everyone, Liz here. Thanks for stopping by. So today I've got a few little packages to open. Uh, the first one is a little box, so we'll get into that one. I do know what this one is because I know where it's from. Um, so we'll open that one first and then I'll show you these. Okay, so this is a custom diamond painting tray that I've had done from Sharon at Shiny Shazza. And that is on Etsy. That's her little logo there. And I think you'll probably guess what it is going to be, if you know me. Lovely little sticker there with her logo on, which is great. And look at this inside. I've not actually opened it and looked at it yet. I did wait for my unboxing and it's been sat here a day waiting for me to do. Okay, so I've got a little sticker there with Shiny Shazza. Say that's her Instagram um, page name if you want to check her out there. And then look at this. This is my little Scotty dog logo. And it's got my friend's dog on it there, who is a Brindle Scotty. It's got Maisie, which was my previous Scotty, who we've lost now, bless her. Um, she passed over the Rainbow Bridge. Uh, oh gosh, it'll be nearly five years ago now. And then our little Millie Moo at the top there. So, and I've got my Scotty dog craft. Now this is a resin tray um, that Sharon has actually made. And look, she's put some lovely little sparkly paw prints in it for me as well. If you can see that, all those different colours. That has taken some doing, that's fantastic. And it's all nicely ridged and it's a good measurement there, flat on the bottom, so it'll sit flat. And we've got a nice little uh, note here so it's saying thank you for your order your order made my day oh that's lovely well thank you Sharon opening this order has made my day as well I hope really hope that this delivery makes yours as much as it did mine I enjoy oh that is wonderful thank you so caring for your re resin drill tray you've received your new tray and can't wait to try it out for the next few for the next month handle with care Resin is a funny medium and it can take up to 30 days to harden fully. So please use carefully initially. You should notice the difference over the coming days. Okay, and then there's just a little bit because she does do cover minders and magnets as well. So there's a use for that there as well. Oh, but that's wonderful. The little box it's coming as well. So yeah, I'm going to have to be careful using it. There is glitter in this as well. I hope you can, it's picking that up. Let me put something black at the back of it is that picking it up can you see the glitter shining in there possibly possibly it's picking it up but yeah that is superb so i've got my own little drill tray with my logo on it and this is the logo i use on the facebook and instagram um, and on my youtube account as well so let's give it a measure and i can tell you how big it is it did come really quickly as well considering Sharon does hand make these she is a lady who's in the UK so it's uh, 11 centimeters which is roughly four and a half inches that way by just under eight centimeters which is just over three centimeters that way and the depth of the tray which is a lovely deep side can see that there is whoa, about a centimetre, about half an inch. So it'll keep your drills in there. Let me just pour a few drills in. I know I'm, what I'm probably going to do is just look at it for the next month anyway, because um, I won't want to cover up the Scotty dogs. So, oops, I've got pearls in this one because these were really uh, terrible static drills. It's a lovely clear tray, this one, so you can see your drills well. Because I have eyesight problems, I tend to find if I say get a, a deep coloured tray, I can't see the drills in it properly. But they've all jumped up, look, and are all sat nice and uh, the right, right way around in that tray, which is superb. Let's get these poured back in, see how we pour. Um, it hasn't got um, a little spout on it, but you can use... Um, a little funnel or you usually don't have that many drills left in your tray when you're tipping them back in anyway so they'll probably all just go into the corner i'm very much a spiller so i tend to throw things around but yeah that's great but look at that tray oh, i just love that superb thank you sharon 
So I will definitely be ordering more. I think I might have to get some for presents as well. Okay, let me put this one away and we'll have a look in the other envelopes. Right, anybody who's familiar with uh, Rebecca at 4Kids at 147's drill storage idea, where you have all your drills in, these are photo boxes, and number all your drills and keep them all in spare little baggies, will uh, fully understand the labels that I've just received. Um, this is a first generation of doing my drill storage. Each drill number, which is the DMC codes, has um, a little card in it with the number on, and behind it, I put a bag with either the round or the square drills in. The full details of doing this, I'm not going to do this because it is Rebecca and Megan, as I say, 4kids at 147.com or 4kids at 147. I'll put all the links down below um, for the. Uh, YouTube channel. She, Rebecca has got full videos showing you how to do all the storage and how she does it. But they have started selling um, the labels that they're printing out and doing for you now. So that's the... So I've had two orders because I ordered one lot and thought I wish I'd ordered the other lot now as well. So I've ordered two lots. So let me just show you these. Okay, I believe my invoices are in here as well. Um, I have got some other bags coming to get my drills because I do need some more. So this is a full set of the DMC numbers, I believe, that are currently used and possibly some of the ones that have been used in the past. But you do get blanks as well. So if you are wanting to, say, put your um, special drills or your AB drills, your Aurora Borealis drills, or your um, Crystal Gems, then you can do that as well. Now, these ones are pre-cut, so I won't have to cut them out, so they've all come pre-cut. So that's a full set there, which is great. I just thought I quite liked the uh, green and the pink, just to jazz up my storage. I mean, it's like pink flowers with green leaves, so... I just think that looks great. So that's all those. And as I say, at the back, you do get a few blanks. And then you do get the hundreds, two hundreds, three hundreds. So you can section off your box a little bit easier. And if you're wanting to use your special, your crystal gems, then you've got um, purple, pink, red, blue, silver, black, yellow, green, orange and white. And then your few spare blank ones that you can use as well. So anybody familiar with DMC numbers will know these from uh, cross stitching. And of course, these are, if you look on canvases or hear other uh, YouTube creators mentioning uh, DMC numbers, then a lot of the canvases and the little bags that you get your drills in do have these DMC numbers on. And it's just a great way when you've finished doing your diamond painting to store away all your spare drills. So that if in future you've run out of a colour or you decide you want to do a custom um, painting or just want to play about and put some drills on, you know what your colours are. So that's the first thing I got. Oops, put drop them on the floor, Liz. Don't be silly. Now then, these are the lovely little stickers that they've started doing as well. You can use these either again for your storage or you can use them for your pots or you can use them to number up your drills as you're going along. And what they've done is I've got the, you can get them in just a solid colour if you wish and you buy them by the page. And what I've done is get the graduated colours, the different ones, because I couldn't decide. I'm no good at deciding things, so... Show it that way, look, so you can see the colours a bit better. So I've gone for one that's got uh, one, two, three, four, five, six different colours on it. And I've got one page of the little squares. So I've got square stickers with the diamond on and they're a nice pale colour. So you can write over the top of them. And then you've just got a diamond in the background, which is really sweet. It's going to look really good. So that's squares for square diamonds, square drills. And then I've got round ones for round diamonds or round drills, which is great. So that's, I'm not quite sure how I'm going to use those yet, but I've got them. So I'm quite pleased with those and I love the colours. And then these, I just thought these were a wonderful idea. Now I'm going to use them on the back of cards. Um, 
but you can use them on your back of your canvases. And the first one, you get one, two, three, four, five, six, six, twelve, eighteen, twenty-four stickers. And the first one says, to add a little sparkle in your life, made with love by. And I just think that's lovely. Rather than just putting handmade by on the back of a card, or if you're gifting somebody a canvas that you've completed for them, um, or even if you're sending, uh, say, a kit for somebody to do, and you just want to put a little message in with it, I just think that's lovely. I just, oh, what a wonderful thing. I'm amazed nobody's thought of it before. And well done, Rebecca and Megan, for doing it. And they're just little square stickers, already pre-cut, so you can just peel them off, add your name onto it, and send them off there. And then the second one, again, 24 stickers, all pre-cut, really good quality these as well and there's quite a bit of stick to that sticker and then it just says each diamond placed by hand for you by and you can put your name and then as well of course it will let people know that you have handmade the card or handmade the uh, picture that you give them because sometimes people won't realize if they don't know anything about diamond painting there are people still out there that don't know about diamond painting <laughs> Hard to believe, I know. Um, they will realise that you have done that for them. And I always think something handmade is just that little bit more special. Okay, so I've got a sheet of each of those. I won't show you my own voice because that's got all my details and my address on it. And then the other thing I got, which they do, which again is really, really handy. These are to go again with my storage. Each of my little um, drip seal bags will have a DMC number on the actual bag and they do little square stickers for your square diamonds. Again, these come in different colours. So I will take that off and 5200 to the white. It's B5200, I think DMC call it. Um, and that will go on the B5200 bag and then it will go behind um, the B5200 a uh, sticker piece of card with it. As I say, check out Rebecca's um, site and you will see exactly how she uses those. And then I've got the rounds as well, which are round stickers to go on round gems, round drills, diamonds, um, so that I can be all organised and I need to be organised. So this is superb, love it. So we've got round stickers, square stickers, all to go on my little bags for all my spare diamonds. We've got a full set of your header stickers, which will um, go in my storage box as well, so that I know where each diamond bag is. And I've got my little stickers that I'm going to put on the back of my cards or the back of my canvases that I gift with the thank yous. And then I've got all my little diamond stickers that i can use on whatever i like so great haul love these well done rebecca and uh, megan sorry rebecca megan's uh, rebecca's daughter so they've been working on these together and i just think it's a lovely idea and it's wonderful of you to share it all with us and um, pop along to their shop and they have got all this and anything that they don't sell they do give you the list of their favorite things that they do like to uh, use as well and where to buy them from and then of course we started off with our lovely little scotty dogs little tray from shiny shazza so uh, thank you sharon okay that's it for now thank you for watching if you've enjoyed the video please press the like button and if you want to see more then please press the subscribe button and i'll see you all again soon thanks for stopping by